Uh, I was just ecstatic. I mean, I realized how much of an honor it is to be inducted in, in, into this Hall of Honor and just the initial shock and just the gratitude and the thankfulness and, and just all these, these feelings that have kind of rushed back and these memories that have kind of rushed back. I mean, it's, it's, it couldn't be a better experience for me. I grew up at uh, the Boletary Tennis Academy, which is now IMG Academy. My father was actually one of the founding members there. Just kind of fell in love with it, fell in love with the competitiveness of the sport, the individualistic challenges that, that come with the sport, and learned a lot from it. Well, you know, it's funny, I, uh, I ended up graduating high school not thinking that I was going to go to college. Uh, I decided kind of last minute and fell in love with Austin, fell in love with the school, fell in love with the girls on the team. About three weeks later, I was here. You know, the thing that stands out probably the most is just the times that we had in like the van and stuff that we had at like the hotels and stuff like that. I do remember very clearly the moment that we won it where we all ran out on the court and, um, and gave each other a big hug and tackled each other and all that. Those special memories that you have with, you know, eight of your closest friends um, keep with you forever. You know, being a student athlete and especially at such a prestigious school as Texas, there's no other way it can best prepare you for life in, in particular, and, and even being a mother. The skills that you learn to manage your time, to prioritize um, you know, certain things, to, to organize your day, um, all of those things, if you do it well, you're gonna be able to succeed, and uh, you know, it's skills like that that you need to succeed in life. He was such a good manager, and he had just, just kind of this quirky way about him that made it fun but made us work incredibly hard. You know, I don't think I've ever worked harder as far as training wise than I was at Texas, but I also had the most fun doing it. So I've tried to, you know, emulate that being the coach at, at South Florida now and trying to just push my girls every day to, to be better and better. It's really just being thankful for it. Um, you know, thankful for the opportunities, thankful to Coach Moore for taking a chance on me in, in, in the very beginning. And um, you know, to see all that kind of recognized into this, this package and, and being here today, um, I couldn't be more grateful. I'm Christina Moros. I'm a Longhorn for life. Hook'em.